Hi guys, today we're going to be looking at a question on the survival rate of lizards due to natural selection. Lizards of a certain species on an island are usually brown in colour. A mutation in one gene for body colour results in red or black lizards. Black lizards camouflage well against the dark rocks and warm up faster on cold days, which gives them energy to avoid predators. Scientists investigated the relationship between the colour of lizards in a population and their survival rate on an island. They conducted the investigation as follows. They selected a group of lizards of a certain species in a habitat. They recorded the percentage of each colour, being brown, red or black, in the selected group. They repeated the investigation over a period of 30 generations of offspring. Question 3.2.1 State the A. Independent variable In this investigation, the independent variable is the color of the lizard. And our dependent variable is the survival rate of the lizard. Question 3.2.2 Explain the effect of the mutation on the survival rate of the red lizards. So as we can see, the red lizards in the initial population are only 10%. However, as it go as the generations go on, it goes from 10% to 0%, showing that they didn't survive. Therefore, the mutation that caused the red color lizards decreases the survival rate. And this is due to the red lizards being seen on the rocks and not being as camouflaged. Question 3.2.3 .3. Explain why the scientists had to conduct this investigation over 30 generations. So the scientists conducted this investigation over this long period of time in order to allow for enough time for reproduction and survival in order to be able to calculate the percentage of survival and ensure reliability of the results. Question 3.2.4 State two ways in which the scientists could have improved the validity of the investigation. So to improve the validity, they could conduct the investigation in the same habitat or they could use the same sampling technique on each color of lizard. Or alternatively, you could have said they can capture the same number of li lizards in each sample generation. Question 3.2.5 Use the theory of natural selection to explain the higher percentage of black lizards in the population of the 30th generation. So using the theory of natural selection, we can say that there's variation amongst the colors of li well, the color in lizards. They are red lizards and brown lizards and black lizards. The red and brown lizards are not camouflaged very well and cannot warm enough for warm up fast enough. Therefore, they have little energy to run away from predators and have a higher chance of being killed by the predators. Whereas the black lizards are better camouflaged and are able to warm up faster and have enough energy to avoid predators. This allows them to survive and therefore reproduce. And as a result, they pass on the allele for the black color to the next generation, resulting in more lizards with more black lizards. Question 3.2.6. Draw a bar graph to compare the percentage of the brown and the black lizards in the initial population and the 30th generation. So since they say draw a bar graph to compare the percentage of brown and black lizards in the 30th generation and initial population, we then draw a comparative bar graph. So on the x-axis I put initial population and 30th generation however you could have put black and brown for the two colors and then you just make a key for your two bars so this one would be brown and then the shaded bars would be black. you could have swapped the initial population and put the populations here in the key and then put your colors on the x-axis either way is fine as long as you don't forget the key. And then on the side it will be, in this case, percentage of color in each population, and then generation on our x-axis. And then don't forget to have, to give your graph a title, where in this case we could say, comparison of the percentage of the brown and black lizards in the initial and 30th generation. Obviously when you draw your graph, it'll be a lot neater than mine. This is just a rough sketch, but Please draw with a ruler and make sure your lines are scaled properly. And that's all for this video. Thank you.